Good morning, Paris. This is your exit route by the Moulin Rouge and a few little train station pictures along the way. In Paris, we enjoyed ourselves thoroughly for the entire three days, and now we are off to experience Breton. I want my time with you. And when we get it with you, we get to visit Irish pubs in England. English pubs in England. Red telephone booths. Proper black British taxi cabs. Proper British red double check your buses. The shows at the West End in Piccadilly Circus, including your Waldorf Hotel, where we're not staying tonight because we're staying in the Miley White House Hotel. But you know what? The place that we're staying is freaking dynamite. So, if you want to come and join us on a tour of London, stick around because we've got more to show you than just the London Eye and Big Ben. Big Ben and Parliament coming around again, kids. Look at that, London Eye. You guys got to come here. Oh, wait. Did we have blue skies and puffy white clouds in all of our pictures? Do you want to eat in Poland? Maybe have some progies and a shot of ouzo? Hmm? Come to London. Experience what the rest of the world has been experiencing for like a million years. Christmas decorations here are impeccable, second to none. We drove by Harrods earlier. This is the Museum of Natural History here. We were across the street from Buckingham Palace. The king was not home today. We checked. I texted him. He didn't respond. The guards are still wearing black in honor of the passing of uh, the queen. Little dippy pictures about. Hello everybody, welcome to London Town. We are at Buckingham Palace. King Charles is not here today. There would be a different kind of flag if he were. But this whole square leads up to Buckingham Palace and the red represents the red carpet. Behind you, a beautiful gilded statue across the street. I believe that's St. James Park. Uh-huh. And the crowds here are watching the changing of the guard right now. That's right. There he is. Changing of the guard. Changing of the guard. What'd they say, every two hours? Every two hours they change the guard. Yep. Mm -hmm. so, Good stuff. Come on along. We already had a, a glimpse of Big Ben uh, Parliament. And if you look over to Glenn's left, there is the London Eye. Eye. Yep. And uh, here's the other thing. We have blue skies. Just like we did three years ago. Puffy white clouds here yeah. in London today, which is absolutely unheard of. But you are getting a first class view today. Nice. Whatever you do, don't forget to swing by Westminster Abbey where they crown kings, marry princesses, and bury their dead. Big Ben is not really the tower. The tower is called the Queen's Tower. Big Ben is the bell inside of the Queen's Tower. They have horses. They store them on the second floor. Hardware, children's wear, ladies' lingerie, and horses. Don't forget what Trafalgar Square is because we're going there for the Christmas market tomorrow. There's more statues around town. We were at by Royal Albert Hall and saw that statue. I was like, oh my God, look at that statue. And here is Arids, no longer owned by Alpha. Well, we just arrived in our London hotel. Would you look at this? Beautiful, amazing bathroom, just like Perry. Our bags are here. Look at this beautiful setup, huh? Coffee station. Woo! Nice closet. Yeah. Fancy hands. Double beds. Woo! Let's see our view. Ah, it's still okay. But I'll take it. At least you can see the street. I'll take the hot man in the orange shirt. The last time we stayed in London, you couldn't see nothing. You I know. Any windows. This is great, you guys. Mm-hmm. It's called the Melia. Yeah. M-E-L-I-A? Oh. Amelia Whitehouse. Amelia Whitehouse. Oh. All right. So, had to really show this off. So, our video today, when you guys are checking it out, it's a little bit bass-ackwards because 
We showed you pictures first. He decided to take us on our tour of the city first. And then we uh, got to do some video at Buckingham Palace. And now they've just brought us to our room. So coming up next, we're going to, I guess, meet up with the group for 6 o'clock. And walk the neighborhood. And walk the neighborhood and eat. Eat. I'm so hungry. Yep. Stay tuned for more. Where are you now? Where are you now? Hello again. We walked to Yamas Greek restaurant, a lively Greek restaurant here in the Camden town, part of London. And uh, it was only a short walk, for about 20 minutes. Look at this place. There are some pictures on the menu. In case Picture you, menus are fun, yeah. In case you don't read English, you can look at the pictures and order from the pictures. There you go. Do you understand the King's English? Good. <laughs> Let's see. Here we go. That. I don't know. They look like croquette balls. And I know that they have some feta cheese in there because I can see a chunky of it over here. That's tzatziki sauce, just like with your gyro. Hey, that was my feta cheese. And you dip the balls in the in the tzatziki sauce and let's see what you get. Vegetables. Very good. Check out the soda. This is their version of Coke. No sugar. So we had a nice salad here. We've got a couple of skewers. One beef, one chicken. One pork, one chicken, one lamb. Skewer. A little uh, french fries, some tzatziki sauce, some pita bread, and some water. Ketchup, please. Thank you. And I will have some ketchup for our prawn fries. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I'm not. Thank you. I'm so Who needs a nap now? Well, do you think if we ordered the $38 model of this instead of the $24 model, huh. how much food we would have wasted? <laughs> this is just, just the perfect amount of food. That's right. We had. We had pile of gyro made three skewers, pita bread, salad, mayonnaise, tzatziki sauce, and a pile of french fries. And ouzo! And ouzo. <laughs> how, about the, how about this stuff? Is this stuff not good or what? Green cola. There's no sugar, no aspartame, no preserve. There's 100% coast flavor. I know, right? It was good. Where are you now? Excuse me. Where are you now? Where are you now? Camden Town, London. And Ooh. let's finish our wonderful Greek experience. Experience. Woo! It was loud in there, and it was it was a very it was so nice much ride. fun. I was so happy because it said that they weren't really busy when I first looked the place up. Uh, I was like, oh no, we're gonna get. Lucia this and Glenn came to town. It got busy. Yesterday's gyros <laughs> and stuff. And we got there, and the place was hopping with people. But show people oh, this place. The food was so, so good. Check out them red double-decker buses up there. Oh, yeah. The cheapest way to get around London. Yep. All right. What's the line up here? What's this crowd? Oh, I don't know. What are they waiting for? The bus. No. What? Coco? What's Coco? Oh. Oh. Uh, they had the Fashion Week Awards in town tonight. They closed Royal Albert Hall. What is this? I don't know. A theater. Yeah. It's a theater. It's a theater? Yep. Oh, okay. So they're all waiting in line for the uh, 8 o'clock show there. It's 10 to 8. Whew. Everybody arrives at the same time. Yeah. We are out to look for an Irish pub. Behind our hotel. Probably the one behind of our, uh, of our hotel. Yep. All right, let's go there next. Please call me after. Where are you now? 
after December 8th. Well, we're in the quilt and artichoke, the Queen's Head and artichoke, a real Irish pub. I came inside, I asked them what the television was, and they said, we don't have a telly. No telly tonight. That's what you got your phone for. Lucia will entertain you all evening long. <laughs> Mm -hmm. And I, um, I understand that you um, here in England go over to the counter to order and you come back here and, and wait. He's making me some hot wine. And, and the first thing that I told the girl when I was talking to her is that she normally doesn't let me talk to pretty girls for this often. Right? Right. Okay. So does that then. What's in my hand? Uh, Non-alcoholic beer made in America. And you're drinking <laughs> in a pub in London. Ah, ha, ha. So tune in tomorrow for some more debauchery with Pucci and Glenn. Do you have anything we're, to say? We're still eating. We're still drinking. Lucy hasn't faded completely on me yet. I'm almost there. So we're enjoying the rest of our time here in London one day at a time. See you Tomorrow's tomorrow. Harry, Potter, Harry Potter. Harry Peter. What? Did you say Harry Tomorrow's Harry Potter Day. It's going to be good. Good night, folks. I'll be the last one left when the lights go out.